Avacodus. UML interaction overview diagram illustrates the flow of control of the interactions with the nodes that consist of interactions or interaction occurrences. In other words, it is a high-level abstraction that illustrates the flow of activity between diagrams. Basically, overview interaction diagram is like an activity diagram in which the elements were replaced by small sequence diagrams, or is like a sequence diagram broken down by the markup of the activity diagram that illustrates the flow of control. Here are the main nodes used in the diagram. Initial node, decision node, fork node, join node, and activity final node. There are several node types, such as interaction diagram, marked as SD, sequence diagram, of any kind. It may appear in line as an activity invocation. Reference to the interaction, marked as REF, also called interaction use. With its help, large and complex sequence diagrams can be greatly simplified. It is also common to reuse some interaction between several other interactions. So let's analyze the diagram step by step. The diagram shows an example of an onboarding process. The employee must first accept or reject the offer. Note that second option does not contribute to the onboarding process. After accepting the offer, the employee must register with HR and apply for a company car. After both actions were completed, the employee must actually begin to work, for example, onboard new customers. If the employee doesn't do that after a certain probation period, the contract gets terminated. Here are a few more examples to examine. Here is how we can depict the interaction with the code lock on the door using the interaction of view diagram. Interaction use enter the code first appears with the argument invalid code, then the interaction follows. Indicate that the code is entered incorrectly, which is displayed on the diagram using the built-in fragment from the sequence diagram. The following is a decision node with a valid pin code interaction constraint. This means that only if the code is entered correctly, the grant access interaction follows. This is followed by an interaction use, let's call it door opening. The door is now unlocked, end of story. But if the code was entered incorrectly, nothing will happen. However, we will also be redirected to the activity final note. And here is a simple hotel room reservation scheme. However, this time we utilize only the interaction use nodes to provide a high level of abstraction. Register the website, select available room type and dates. If there are no rooms available for these dates, we are redirected back to where we can choose other rooms or dates. If all goes well, then we proceed to checkout. If everything is fine there as well, the room is booked. Of course, this is a primitive example and we would potentially append the diagram with many more additional interactions, but it still gives you a sense of how the interaction overview diagram works. Please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel and toll the bell. That was V, thank you and goodbye.